Hi guys, it's Maddie. Welcome back to my channel. Today is Wednesday, January 5th. It is the first vlog on my channel of the new year. Happy 2022. A lot has changed since the last vlog. If you guys watched my life update video, which will already be up, that explains everything. But if you didn't watch that, you're probably a little lost. But basically, I moved out of my old apartment. My lease there was up and I don't have a new apartment lined up yet. So I'm staying at my parents temporarily. So that's where I am now. And I also am still a working gal. I got promoted from an intern to a junior influencer strategist at my job. So I'm staying at the same company this year. So I'm working from home today. So I thought I would vlog a couple of work days and just take you guys along. Also, I'm vlogging on my phone. Please excuse that. But my vlogging camera somehow got lost in the chaos of moving. I know it's around here somewhere. I couldn't have left it at my apartment because I completely cleared the apartment out. Thought it was in a bag that I brought here to my parents' house, but it's not in that bag. So it's either in a different bag or it's in my storage unit, which would be a big problem. Hopefully it turns up soon, but we might be getting phone vlogs for the next few weeks. Which speaking of apartments and moving, I toured an apartment yesterday that I actually really loved and I'm going to apply to it today. Hopefully, fingers crossed, I get accepted for that apartment and things might be moving a little quicker than expected. So positive vibes for that, but we'll see. Let's go downstairs. This is my work setup in my parents' basement. It's really great. Just kidding, it's horrible. I can't wait to have an actual desk set up, but for a couple weeks, this will do. Hi guys, it is now the end of the work day. My mom's making pizza for dinner right now. That is one part of living at home is I don't have to figure out dinner for myself every night. But now that I'm done with work for the day, I've just been sitting on my laptop and spending some time online shopping because I've been trying to figure out like what vibe I wanna go for for my new apartment and like what furniture I'm gonna need because as soon as I find a new apartment, I wanna have like everything ready to go because it's probably gonna move pretty quickly. So furniture can take a while to arrive. So I just wanna have everything picked out. But speaking of online shopping, this is a good segue to today's sponsor, which is Karma. I've talked to you guys about Karma before, but just as a little refresher, Karma is an app and a Chrome extension that ensures that you never miss a price drop or a coupon code ever again. If you don't already have Karma on your computer browser or your phone. It's super easy to download and it's completely free. Once you have the Chrome extension downloaded, there will be a little blue button that pops up anytime you're shopping on any of your favorite stores. And when you see an item you like, you could just click the button and save it to any of your different lists. So you can organize yourself into all different wish lists. So I started one for apartment stuff. So every time I've seen a piece of furniture or a decor item that I like, I've just been saving it to my apartment list so that everything is all in one place. And I don't forget about stuff that I saw but also most importantly if any of those items go on sale I will get notified that there was a price drop and then when I'm ready to purchase any of these items Karma also has a feature that scans the web for coupon codes and automatically applies them at checkout so you can always be sure you're getting the best price for whatever you're purchasing it's so much easier than manually searching through the whole internet to find the best coupon codes and again it is completely free to download so there's absolutely no reason why you shouldn't already have it downloaded on your phone or computer Plus, Karma also offers cash back on a ton of different websites. So you can go to karmanow.com and see which stores offer cash back. Having this downloaded will save you so much time and money. So definitely click the link in the description if you guys want to download it. It's a lifesaver for me right now as I'm trying to plan out my new apartment because I always see different furniture pieces or decorative items and then I forget like what store they were from. So this just helps me save everything in one place and also make sure I'm getting the best price. So definitely check it out down below and thank you again to Karma for sponsoring today's video. Also speaking of online shopping, I have been ordering new things over the past few weeks because you know retail therapy and there's been a lot of sales like after christmas so i have a little haul of some things that i've purchased recently most of it is from abercrombie abercrombie was having such good sales right after christmas so i stocked up on just a lot of good basics from them and then i also ordered a few things from shop bop and oh this sweater that i'm wearing from revolve i'll link it down below it's literally so cozy i've been wanting to like invest in a nice quarter zip sweater like this 
my whole Pinterest board for winter 2022 is just like these little cozy quarter zip sweaters with like jeans and mini Uggs like that's my vibe for this winter so I saw this one on the website and it was just so nice standing so you can see it a little better but it's so cozy it's definitely worth the money and I've been wearing it a lot since I got it already it's good for work so yeah I'll link this down below and I'm gonna show you everything else that I got I feel like it's been a minute since we've done a haul in a vlog because this I just like haven't been really shopping for new clothes lately the Abercrombie stuff I haven't tried all of it on yet so I'm gonna try it all on now for you and make sure everything like fits okay starting off with two pairs of jeans that I got from Abercrombie this is my first time buying jeans from Abercrombie since like middle school I feel like everyone raves about them and I was in need of some new jeans so i just got two of the same style one in this blue wash and then one in black they're the curve love 90s straight jean and ultra high rise i got a 27 wow these did not disappoint they fit so well i love how high-waisted they are i usually like jeans to be really long but they were sold out of the long version in a 27 so i just got the regular but they actually like go all the way down to my ankles so they fit perfectly 10 out of 10 i love these okay next we have this sweater that is so cute it's like this kind of burgundy brown color with a little collar and the material is so soft again good for work just to throw on with jeans i think it actually looks really cute with these black jeans love it next up we have another little comfy quarter zip i think this was on sale for literally like 20 dollars, so i was like might as well add it to the cart it's just like a ribbed material and dark gray very comfy a little more of like a sporty look next i just got this basic crew neck sweater i really liked this like taupey color and again it's like in this super soft material it's so comfortable i also picked up a vest i feel like vests made a big comeback and i haven't owned a vest in years so i saw this just like basic black puffer vest i got a size small and it's a little bit big it's very like boxy i don't know how i feel about this look i think it would look better if it was a size down mm, let me know what you guys think i feel like i'm not really loving this vest i'm gonna keep the tags on it for now but let me know what you guys think last thing i got from abercrombie it's just this little bodysuit it's long sleeve very very cute something a little nicer if i ever decide to leave my house again i like the little like cut out layered look right here okay last but not least i got a new pair of shoes i ordered these from shop bop but they're they just i have been wanting a new pair of just like neutral everyday sneakers specifically not to like replace but just be another option instead of air force ones because i literally wear those every day so i picked up these they are so cute just like a nice neutral sneaker i've heard great things about this brand i heard they're a little hard to break in but once they're broken in they're super comfortable my goal is to try to actually keep these clean we'll see if that happens but i know i'm gonna get a ton of wear out of these they're just like a good neutral staple everyday sneaker so that is the last of my recent purchases hi guys good morning it is now thursday it's the last work day of the week for me because i have off fridays i did not feel like getting myself ready today so we're wearing a nice little sweat set you can't see it and i'm vlogging in the bathroom because i am struggling to find good places to film in my parents house it's just like not the vibe i actually got great news this morning i applied for an apartment last night that i saw a couple days ago in jersey city and this morning i got an email saying that i was approved and i'm gonna move forward with signing the lease and i'm gonna be moving in in a couple of weeks i am like so happy and i just feel so relieved because literally apartment hunting has taken over my life for the past like two months so for me to finally find a place and be approved for it and just be able to like sign the lease get everything done and have it set in stone is so exciting i can't wait to have my own space again and take all my stuff out of storage and just get back to like a normal routine again so yeah i wanted to tell you guys the news i can't wait for you guys to see it it's like the most prime location ever it's so close to new york city um it's like on the water it's a very 
busy neighborhood with lots of like restaurants and stuff going on and there's so many like cute walkways where I can walk Lennon and it's just gonna be a really good area and like super easy for me to get into the city when I need to. The apartment itself, it's a one bedroom but it's a little more spacious than my last apartment. There's a lot more like storage and closet space so I think it's gonna be really good. I can't wait to like furnish it and decorate it. So now we have a set time frame for when the moving vlogs are coming. I'm gonna be moving in two weeks. I feel like now I can kind of relax finally and just like enjoy being home at my parents and not be stressed out about trying to find a place and then before we know it it'll be time to move so just wanted to update you guys on that news that came in this morning but now it's just a regular work day I'm gonna head downstairs get my work laptop out and get started working for the day guys it is the end of the day now i just took a shower and washed my hair but it was a very long work day i worked a little bit later than normal till like 7 30 today because i was finishing up a report that needed to be done today if any of you guys are curious as to what i'm working on at my job right now Basically, three of the campaigns that I was working on last year all wrapped at the end of December. So right now in January, I'm working on reporting for those campaigns. So basically, like once all influencer content is live, we collect all of the metrics from the content and like insert it all into Excel spreadsheets and basically like analyze which posts did well and which posts didn't do so well and why. And then we like send a report to the brand to show like our learnings from the campaign. So this is my first time getting to the reporting phase of any of the campaigns I've worked on. And now I'm working on three reports at once. So it's kind of a lot, but it's really interesting stuff and I'm learning so much. And it's actually like relevant stuff that I'm learning, like that I can apply to my own social media career. So it's really interesting. I like working with like numbers and Excel sheets and stuff, but it was just a long day of like staring at a lot of numbers and trying to understand what it all means. So I worked till like 7.30 and then I made dinner for my family and I. I just transferred my every plate subscription to come here now and I upgraded it to the four person plan. So my parents and I can eat that a couple nights a week. But now I just got comfortable and I'm ready for bed. It's like 9.30 I think. But it was a really good work week, very productive. And now tomorrow's Friday and I don't work on Fridays. So it's the weekend. Also it's supposed to snow overnight and it's gonna be like the first actual snow of the year so I'm actually really excited I usually hate the snow but I don't have anywhere I need to be so I'm kind of excited for it to snow last year Lennon really loved when it snowed so I'm excited for her to play in the snow I'm gonna keep vlogging through tomorrow so I will talk to you guys in the morning Hi guys, happy Friday. There is snow on the ground. Um, it's a little later in the afternoon, so some of it's melted now. So I'm in my car. I have a few errands to run. Right now I actually just drove over to my old apartment because I got a couple packages sent here. I don't know what they are, but I'm going to pick those up right now. I got coffee and a bagel for like a late breakfast. And then I'm getting my nails done, which is very exciting because I haven't got my nails done in, I think, over two months. I was giving them a break, trying to grow them out. I wasn't very successful. I think my nails actually grow better when I consistently get them done because otherwise I, like, pick at them too much. So they end up breaking 
So I'm getting just a gel manicure later today. And then I also need to stop by Trader Joe's today and pick up just a few things that I need at the house. Love a good Friday with no work. Just got a package from Tula and one from Kopari. So we'll open these when I get back home. little mini at Trader Joe's haul. My mom asked me to pick up white cheddar popcorn and then I just got kettle corn for myself to snack on. Got some overnight oats, some vanilla yogurts, needed some hold the cones, some shrimp gyozas to have for lunches. Also for lunches, got two of my favorite salads. And lastly, just got two bottles of kombucha that's the haul i'm opening up these packages that i picked up and we've got two products from tula they're both like acne related products so we have a breakout breakthrough toner pads and then we have the breakout star acne moisturizer very excited to try those out then from kopari we have this very fancy package Ooh! so on top i am so excited about this it's their body butter this packaging is so pretty i did that first part wrong this whole thing opens up let me put this back it's a whole thing of body products we have their body butter their coconut melt, their scrub. I love this body scrub. And then we have a pink souffle body mask, but this is all like updated packaging and it's really, really pretty. Thank you, Kopari. I love this gift. Currently working on editing this vlog that you guys are watching right now, snacking on some kettle corn and watching Drag Race. The new season of Drag Race starts tonight. So they've been having like an every episode marathon on logo. So just have this on in the background but i just wanted to end off this vlog because i'm not really doing much the rest of the day just gonna finish editing this video and then watch drag race later tonight which i'm very excited about so i wanted to thank you guys so much for watching this vlog was a little rough on the iphone but i appreciate you watching through to the end anyway i'm gonna go through all my stuff and look for my camera this weekend because I kind of need that but i hope you guys are all having a very happy new year so far and that you enjoyed this video and make sure to subscribe to my channel if you did there are going to be lots of new videos to come especially when i move into my new apartment two weeks from today as i'm filming this so it's gonna come really quickly so yeah make sure you subscribe because lots of new content coming oh here's my cat this is pearl my family cat yep okay cool make yourself comfortable anyway thank you guys for watching and i will see you very soon in another new video bye